everybody i hope you enjoyed the video we got some unexpected rain and an incredible rainbow but also we got introduced by the hall of fame ring announcer carlos kramer he's uh as i said in the hall of fame for mma ring announcing and uh get ready for this i hope you guys enjoy the intro again the guy's the man thanks guys enjoy the video hey i just wanted to uh give a quick shout out to my buddy and uh, he has been amazing. Him and his beautiful wife run Big Bear Weather and more. And man, they've gone viral for several reasons, but most of all, because they keep everybody informed. They keep everybody up to date on current events. And when you own in Big Bear, like I do, and uh, plan my family's uh, coming and going, the weather is crucial to know. And I tell you what, he is up to date, like up to the minute. It's really incredible. Uh, love you, Nick. You are the man. Big Bear, weather, and more, ladies and gentlemen. All you have to do is subscribe. I have one question for you and one question only. Are you ready? What's up, everybody? What's the day today, babe? Today is the 8th, uh, Tuesday. The 8th of August, 2023. We're getting a little bit of rain here in Big Bear. Kind of a little surprise. It wasn't really on the radar for today, but we'll take it for sure. Hope everyone's doing well. Good to see you guys. As I said, it's a big surprise. Say hey, babe. Hey, guys. I just woke up. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to go to Azteca to get Taco Tuesday right now. So I'm excited about that. But yeah, it's seven o'clock in beautiful Big Bear. Hope you all are having a great, great day and a good start to your week. I like these little surprise storms. Yeah, this is really unexpected. Yeah, and I bet it smells really good outside right now. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna roll down the window and see. Oh yeah. Petroquar. Clar, Petro, you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> oh yeah. I wonder if there's over that direction any rainbows possibly. Because there is a lot of sun popping through. But we definitely love this type of weather. My wife isn't looking forward to winter time. I am, but not as much as I have been for all these previous years living here. I'm just not as excited about it because it was it was kind of a struggle this last winter. Yeah, this definitely was a really hard winter and it's coming way too soon. Yeah. Way too soon. Yeah, it's gonna be here before you know it. It really is. But maybe I'll complain less this year and do more skiing or snowplay <clears throat> type of stuff. Yeah, there we go. Because last year I was in the house too cold. I, I Once I'm cold, I'm like just stuck in place. I can't even move. That's the one thing about winter because I'm extremely lazy that uh, it gives me a really good excuse to not have to do anything other than just work, you know? So... There aren't going to be any hikes or anything like that, so that'll be good, but at the same time not good because I've gained so much weight, it's a joke. I need to get back in shape somehow. I know one way I can help. That's inappropriate. <laughs> I've just been giving you more salad. Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> Babe, that's, come on, please. We have women and children watching this channel. For Pete's sakes. All right. <laughs> All right, so we're just gonna go down a little bit. And as a matter of fact, we're, we're gonna have to, that's Glenn. That's Glenn. walks all over town. He's totally, he's totally fine with it. He doesn't mind. But yeah, this is 
is all going to be filled with snow in maybe two and a half months. This whole area right there for the sledding and stuff like that. I know, again, both of us are kind of anxious about the snow coming, but it should, it should be all right. And we're going to just drive past Azteca right now because we have to go in an order because they, they weren't answering the phone. Oh. Yeah. Maybe not doing the phone order thing for Taco Tuesday. Well, they do it every talk on Tuesday, so I, I just think they're well, busy. Think when we call, it's like before closing, though. We usually go later than this. That's, that's true. We usually go about an hour from now, about 8.15-ish, 8, 8.30. But yeah, what a beautiful part of the day. This is gorgeous out here. Sun popping through. Yeah, this isn't going to be a long video. It's just going to be a, a little little update to show you guys what's going on up here. As you guys know, for the eight years I've been doing this, I'm, I have OCD about any time there's any weather to make sure that I go out and record it. Don't know why, but I just have to. But it's good because it gives the channel consistency. And uh, I know that's important for, uh, for people to want to, you know, support something. If you see someone working hard and, and always, always doing what they're supposed to be doing, then you know what, like, that's when I'm willing to help others also is, is when I see someone who's passionate about something, just going for it. It, it feels really good. And I know this is kind of a dorky thing to be passionate about, but I enjoy it a lot. back around and head back to Azteca. The video will end when we get to Azteca. friend, um, Carlos uh, Kramer, he is a Hall of Fame ring announcer for Mixed Martial Arts. He did another introduction for me with the voice that he uses when like, uh, when like Bill Buffer says like, like, let's get ready to rumble or uh, I think it's... Uh, yeah, you put him on your video. Yeah, 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 yeah. That guy. Yeah, so it's, it's Carlos again and I'm very, very blessed that he wanted to do this for us again he's, he's super cool so fun he's a really good dude but yeah he was just inducted into the uh, what I want one of those into the um, hall of fame for <clears throat> for ring announcing so I'm, I'm super proud to know him and even more honored that the dude likes me it's really cool His catchphrase is, uh, are you ready? <laughs> it's pretty cool. So that's what he's gonna do for us on this video. He did it for me maybe three weeks ago or so before I went to Florida. And uh, I'm looking forward to it for sure. This bus did the same little route that we just did. see a rainbow you guys didn't I say so
enough to just pass Azteca just real quick again, just to go around that corner so we can be looking at the rainbow straight ahead, or maybe if we went down Edgemore real quickly. for a second I am starving but we're gonna pass my favorite Mexican joint in Big Bear to go capture this for you guys maybe make it the thumbnail or something but yeah that's really beautiful babe it's a really good one right around this corner it should be really nice Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. That is gorgeous. Wow. That is gorgeous. I just want to try to capture it without any telephone poles and telephone wires and stuff like that. Power power wires. You know what? Maybe it'll be right behind the sign for the village. I think that would be awesome. Make that the thumbnail. <clears throat> okay, here's five fun facts about rainbows. Do you want to hear it or not? No, I don't. Number one, rainbows can only appear directly opposite from the sun. How many of you guys knew that? That's a rainbow contains seven colors. Wow, that's a big one. That's a beautiful one right there. It contains seven colors. Uh -huh. Sometimes a so-called double rainbow forms with a fainter rainbow appearing on top of the main one. Ooh. This occurs when the light is reflecting twice in each raindrop. And four, the sky beneath a rainbow appears brighter than the sky above it. And five, rainbows appear to be a semicircle because the horizon interferes. Ooh. Those were fun facts. I am not enjoying myself. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Look, look at how beautiful that is. Wow. That, yeah, that's something else, you guys. That is something else. Look at it goes all the way. Beautiful. Okay, this is going to be one of our best views right here. It's just awesome. It's really brilliant, isn't it? shredded beef tacos. That really is beautiful. Let me talk to them if they pick up though because I want to make something clear. Do 
losing this rainbow here any any moment. So we gotta just get over here real quickly. There's one area where I think it'll look really, really pretty if we can get there. They aren't answering, are they? Alright, stop sign. So where I usually go to watch the thunderstorms, it'll be a pretty good spot, I think. Oh, I think, if we get there on time. But that sun's going down, so we gotta hurry. But we are in a neighborhood, so we don't wanna really race. I'd be chasing rainbows it's not my style but it's beautiful so we're gonna do that that's God's promise to the world wow 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 when I was in Kauai we took a helicopter tour and you get to see the full shape of, of, of the rainbow and and their circles, which was pretty cool. From the ground, you can only see the half moon looking. All right, so we're almost, oh, look at right on top of that house, babe. That is so cool. Yeah, that is so cool. Whoever's house that is, your house the, the, Good luck, they're gonna have some serious luck. Yeah, totally. That is awesome, I mean, that is incredible. Look at the Wow, that is just so awesome. Not so, from this angle, but from over there, it was just right yeah, it was right on top of the house. So I, cool. I, I think we'll get that angle when we turn left here. This guy, please don't turn left here. All right, uh, that's beautiful. That was really cool. <laughs> yeah, totally. I see it's still you. sprinkling a little right now. It is. It is still sprinkling. Kind of reminds me of when we were in Florida. It does, huh? Alright, once we make this turn right here, we should get a pretty good view of the rainbow. Right there, right on the top of the hill. That is just so cool, guys. All right, well, let's see how much of the rainbow we can actually capture right here. Hey, we got the whole way. Part of it's, it lands in Moon Ridge right there and goes right like that. How cool is that? All right, guys. Well, we're going to go eat right now, but hope you enjoy the video. That's pretty awesome. I don't know. Can you guys see the rainbow straight ahead where the other end is right there? So it's like right on top of our house, babe. No kidding. Just special. Okay, we're, we're going to make it so... It, look, see? It's going right on top of the house right there from from this view. I don't know if you guys can see, but anyway, peace out y'all. Please hit the like and subscribe button, share the video, help us out. Um, I really want this channel to be something special. The first seven years, I didn't really care because it's just a passion of mine. And just to have anyone watching, that was a, still is a big enough blessing. But yeah, if you want to help us out, please hit the like and subscribe button. We'd appreciate it. You want to say bye, baby? Bye everyone. Thank you for watching, and we will talk to you guys later. Peace out.